Hey guys, I'm Kate Spring, dating and relationship coach from Victoria, BC. I've been asked this question a lot lately about why women lose interest in men. I've thought long and hard over this and talked to my girlfriends and also tried to remember why I personally have lost interest in men in the past. And I think I've come up with a few reasons as to why women start to lose interest in the initial stages of a budding romance. Now, if you're still curious about more do's and don'ts in the initial stages of your relationship, at the end of this video, please ask questions in the comment section below or leave me comments about more things you would like to hear from me and I'll be sure to get back to you as soon as I can. Okay, so I think one reason why a woman loses interest in a man is if her rose colored glasses fall off and she realizes that she doesn't appreciate some of his manners. One of those reasons can be rudeness. Rude to customer service people, to her, to anyone really. If this is the case and your rudeness is an unsuccessful attempt to be funny, I might suggest you work on a type of humor that doesn't bring people down in order to get a laugh. I know there is that old saying that nice guys finish last, but don't be mistaken as to how far being kind to your love interest will go. Having an ability to make light of situations and not get attached to your expectations will work wonders for you, I promise. You might be wondering what I mean by this. Here's an example. Say you and your girl are on a date and say you go to a restaurant that doesn't have any record of your reservation. Instead of causing a fuss and being rude to the hostess or manager, use your well-polished problem-solving skills and ask to sit at the bar. Or you could say to her, hey, let's try this other great little spot down the street. Or better yet, say, hey, let's go to the grocery store and I'll cook for you. Either of these options is better than being rude to someone. And remember that circumstance doesn't create your character, it simply allows it to be revealed. If this advice is already helping you, please like and subscribe to my channel where you can find more helpful videos in understanding your crush, but only do so after this video. Okay, another thing that causes women to lose interest is when you're indecisive. Having an opinion is sexy, period. And asserting yourself respectfully is a real panty dropper. So if you're indecisive about things like where to eat dinner, what movie to watch, where to go, what you wanna do, this creates an indecision that wastes both time and energy. The result is that more time is spent in indecision than in having fun. Having an opinion and making a decision is better than not having one. One thing that directly correlates to being indecisive is becoming complacent in your budding relationship too early on or complacent at all. We all become comfortable at some point in a relationship and settle into routine, which is not always a bad thing. It's just that women like to be wanted as do men. And that has to do with nice messages, being physically affectionate, just still trying to impress the other person. Say you have finally asked your crush to be your girlfriend and she said yes. Just because we have this mutual agreement doesn't mean we can take the other for granted. On the contrary, now is when the fun and hard work starts to pay off. My sister recently reminded me of another early relationship killer and she calls it smothering. Smothering comes in many forms. It can be excessive texting and or calling, hanging out to the point where you don't have any chance to miss the other person. All of these fit the description. Part of relationship excitement involves the chase and building tension. There is a real benefit in gradually getting to know one another. I think women lose interest when they feel smothered. Being eager is not a bad thing, but a little mystery at the beginning stages keeps things light and fun. So when you're really into a girl, yay, but try to find a balance between showing your interest and letting things happen naturally, not all at once. To learn more about avoiding smothering, especially in texting, go check out my ebook I've written for you guys and get it free at katespring.com slash free. In that, you will find some helpful texting advice and templates that are sure to build attraction. That's katespring.com slash free. And I'll be sure to leave the link in the description below. Okay, another reason why women lose interest is when someone is all talk, when your intentions don't match your actions. I was taught very early on never to get into a relationship for its potential. This is another way of saying that what you see or hear is what you get. Being all talk and no action is not the best way to start a meaningful relationship. Talk is cheap. The supply always exceeds the demand. Put your words into action because words create expectations. And when women are presented with unmet expectations, we find ourselves let down and oftentimes are no longer interested in the man with no follow through. And lastly, one of the inevitable reasons why women lose interest in a man is because she just realizes that maybe you aren't meant to be together and that's okay. Often we're first physically attracted to someone and lust is a powerful force that can make us do some pretty crazy things. But when that begins to fade, we may be left questioning if we have similar interests, the same goals, aspirations, and values. At this point, 
we may also start to realize that our intimate encounters would be better left as a fling. This is one of those things that happens and why resilience is key in a relationship and a must in your personal arsenal of coping mechanisms. All right, that's all I have for you today, YouTube. If you would like to hear more first-hand advice on the secrets of the female mind, please subscribe to my channel below. Thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.